The Sioux Falls School District has a new winter sport. This week, high school athletes found out that powerlifting is now a sanctioned sport funded by the district, but only for girls. The news comes in the wake of a Title IX lawsuit over gymnastics, and just two weeks after the district released a statement saying, quote, it would actively work to increase female participation in sports while adjusting male participation. The weight room at Washington High School was empty around 2.30 this afternoon. However, the boys and girls who make up the school's powerlifting team have been hard at work in this room for more than a month. This week, girls on the team got some surprising news. Now we're going to make it an official uh, sponsored sport by the Sioux Falls School District. They do go to competitions. They go to a state tournament and have that competition there. And so we've made sure that we're adding that in. It's another one that's growing fairly significantly. Girls powerlifting joins other winter sports like basketball, wrestling, and gymnastics. Both the boys and girls have been participating in the club sport at Sioux Falls High Schools for many years. When we start to see the numbers that were in, in powerlifting uh, from the year before for our female athletes, uh, one of the schools had had over 50 students, uh, female students, that were participating in powerlifting. And it became evident that it was something that we would want to expand and, and have that opportunity at each one of the schools. Nolte says the boys' powerlifting in Sioux Falls will remain a club sport, at least for now. The girls' state powerlifting tournament is scheduled for March in between the state basketball tournament dates. Nolte says they constantly evaluate what the students are interested in and try to offer those opportunities. Girls wrestling was also added in 2020 after the district saw a lot of interest. Girls softball was added last year.